Differences between hypothesis formulation and hypothesis development. Hypothesis formulation versus hypothesis development. Hypothesis formulation is the process of creating possible, tentative, solutions explanation for a given set of information, study or research. Whereas hypothesis development is the process of creating a null hypothesis from research question and hypothesis. The purpose of hypothesis formulation is to predict what they expect to find from the study results, falsifiable, operationalized, clear all variables and avoid guesswork. Whereas the purpose of hypothesis development is to state clearly research question, linkage between variables, hypothesis, and null hypothesis. The whole process of creating and formulating hypothesis starts from observation, hypothesis formulation and hypothesis testing. Whereas, the process of hypothesis development mainly consider the existing evidence and using reasoning to infer what will happen in the specific context of interest. There are six steps in hypothesis formulation. Number one step is understand the area of problem. Number two step is consider goal. Number three step is identify variables. Number four step is identify the relationship between variables. Number five step is think critically about hypothesis. And number six step is express idea as own hypothesis. Whereas there are six steps in hypothesis development. Number one step is ask a question. Number two step is do some preliminary research. Number three step is formulate your hypothesis. Number four step is refine your hypothesis. Number five step is phrase your hypothesis in terms of simple prediction in terms of if and then form, correlations or effects and comparing two groups. And number six step is write a null hypothesis. Hypothesis formulation is third step of research process. Whereas hypothesis development is done after hypothesis formulation but before hypothesis testing. In hypothesis formulation, null hypothesis is not in proper form. For example, the hypothesis extracted form literature is employees who have flexible working hours will report greater job satisfaction than employees who work fixed hours. Whereas in hypothesis development, null hypothesis is in proper form. For example, Null hypothesis extracted form literature is, there is no or negative relationship between working hours flexibility and job status action. In hypothesis formulation, the example of alternative hypothesis is, employees who have flexible working hours will report lower job satisfaction than employees who work fixed hours. Whereas in hypothesis development, the example of alternative hypothesis is, there is positive relationship between working hours flexibility and job status action. How is hypothesis formulated? To answer this question, Reichen back in 1938 specified two processes such as context of discovery and context of justification. Context of discovery in which findings, existing theories and personal observations, and experience in which hypothesis is discovered from earlier research and context and justification in which a research constructs his thoughts and communicates them in the form of a hypothesis to others, he uses the context of justification. How is hypothesis developed? To answer this question, Hypothesis development is experience-based and can be written easily from literature review. There are some difficulties in hypothesis formulation such as lack of awareness of scientific research methods, lack of knowledge of theoretical framework and evidence, and unavailing of theoretical framework and evidence. Whereas, there are some difficulties in hypothesis development such as lack of knowledge, complex research question, insufficient data, bias and preconceptions, lake of creativity and critical thinking, and balancing specificity and generality.
kindly subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper. Thanks for watching.